Hi, my name is Patricia Griggs and I am a content creator. When I was a kid, I wanted to be an actress and a dancer and a singer. So what I would do is I would pretend one day that I was Dorothy from Dorothy and the Visitor of Oz and other days I would pretend that I was Annie. I um, got some ugly words spoken to me when I told some peers that I was going to be an actress and it really affected me. I graduated from the University of Texas, got my degree in social work, and I loved it. I loved helping people and I loved my job and then one day I just, I woke up and I just decided that I couldn't do it. I was screaming on the inside. That's when I knew that I needed to let go of all the fears and all of the lies that I had fed into before and just take the plunge and go for acting. And with that, I met some really incredible people. We thought we were pretty awesome and we thought we could do anything, so we decided to start a magazine. Working on the magazine was fun. I loved acting, loved the group of friends that I had. We were so supportive and so encouraging of each other. We really created this incredible community. And we were all gonna move out to LA and just take the world by storm. LA was hard. LA was so hard. It was like, I would take two steps forward and then get thrown like five or six steps back. It was the hardest thing I'd ever done, but I loved it because there was this energy that was in the air and there were these people and, you know, everybody was just hustling towards something and, you know, if, if they maybe came out there for acting, but they created their own little niche of what they could do and, and there was just so much creativity and it was just awesome being in that environment and I visualized in my mind what I was going to have and it was going to be mine. <sighs> but that didn't happen. About a month after I moved back from Los Angeles to Austin, I lost my dad. It was unexpected and it was um, hard. And for the first time in a long time, I felt really lost. I mean, I had this plan, this plan for my life, and everything seemed to go just as I had expected it to go. And then LA happened, and then my dad, and I just didn't know what I was gonna do with myself or what I was supposed to do in my life. When I was in LA, I started blogging, so that was something really enjoyed doing in my free time. That was never anything that I had thought about doing. It was just something that I did that I really just enjoyed. I would stay up all hours of the night um, writing and writing and perfecting the blogs and I did that for a long time and I really loved it. The whole LA experience um, really made me think that I should there just kept going on and on and on. You should write a book, you should write a book, and then you know, I'm pushing to the side and saying, I don't know. I'm going to write a book. I'm going to write a book. But when my dad died, the book I did, I to see the book. It was something that I wanted to do. I became a mom. I have two amazing children. Syracuse, it just seemed like it was the right fit for me. I love this program. My classmates are some of the most brilliant and creative people I have ever met, and I get to work with some of the most amazing professors in the world. I am challenged daily, but I welcome every single challenge. I press on, I grow, I learn, and this is exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm a content creator, so I'm 
creating content, and I will create content, whether it's text or video or audio, that is who I am. My goal is to create content that encourages people and helps them to figure out who they're supposed to be and what they're supposed to be doing. And I will do this until 